friends welcome to learn abacus in last video we had to discuss about what is meant by abacus and why abacus learning is important in today's video we have to discuss about the part of abacus the part part of abacus we have to discuss here with the help of figure this is the figure of abacus that figure is called as a frame of abacus now in this figure the outer part it is called as frame okay and the uh, we have to see here bits is there that is called as bits this is the upper bits and this is the lower bits the upper bits the upper bits and the lower bits are divided into one sleeping line that is called as divider beam middle rod divider or unit rod in this unit rod we have to see in the white dot white dot this white dot it is called a unit point this is the upper bits or it is also called as a heaven bits and this yeah this is the lower bits the lower bit it's also called a earth bit the vertical line we have to see in here that is called as rod in this abacus figure there are 11 rod different abacus have a different rod now we can very well understood with the help of abacus just like this is the student abacus which is helpful for the student to calculation the arithmetic calculation okay the outer part it is the outer part it is called as a frame of abacus this is the divider or unit uh, unit bar the white dot is appear for the unit bar it's called a unit point and these are the upper bits the value of upper bit is always 5 and the value of lower bit that is earth bit the value of earth bit is 1 now this this is the frame of abacus and the abacus is an rectangular size so in next video we have to discuss about how to place the beads and how to identify the number with the help of our index finger and thumb and unit point so if you like my video then like share and subscribe thanks for watching